right, so had a problem with this rear caliper, the parking brake. Lever seized on it. Um, I got here a, a Nugion Reman, ready to go on. These pop up like one one at a time, randomly on Rock Auto. Kind of pricey, but in this case, um, uh, I went ahead and. Yeah, in this case, it was worth it just because the uh, parking brake is kind of weak on the other side. I may end up replacing the other one, but we'll see. I'm looking to see if there is. Yeah, this is a, not an original. Yeah, this is a, a clone, Chinese clone. There's no markings on it to denote that that's a um, that that's an actual sob caliper but as long as it stops the car that's all that matters and there goes the clip it always pops out on me yeah, I'll deal with that later Brand new pads, ready for it. And that's a seven millimeter hex on the pin holding the caliper on. Let me pull that caliper off. Where's the other one at? It's down here somewhere. There it is. Get this cable out of the way. Gonna get these cover dirt plugs, dirt covers off. And there's one all the way down there. Now we need to pop the safety spring off. Where's my screwdriver? Just pop that out like that. This thing wants to be stubborn. There we go. Now I just need to unscrew the line from it and screw the other one on. Pull these pads out so they don't get brake fluid on them. I grab my thumb in the 
Oh, right there to hold it. This is the hardest part, is getting it started without cross-threading it. I think I got it. Yep. This one actually comes with a new bracket, which I don't need, but I will keep it as a spare. <clears throat> Put this pad in first. And this one. Oh, come back here. Adjust it. All right. That is definitely sticking way too far out. And the spreader pretty much said, no, I'm not going in anymore. Let me see if I can encourage it to go in anymore <clears throat> let me try something <clears throat> that is all the way Oh, there we go. Put some pressure on it and let it go in. As you back that out. There we go. Get the drips off. 